This is the Lock Picking Lawyer, and what I have for you today is one of the better motorcycle disc brake locks currently on the market. It's the Abus Granite Sledge 77, and Abus got a lot right when they put it together. We can start with the 5mm thick hardened steel outer lock body. Inside of that is a hardened steel sliding carriage, and that's where you put the disc brake rotor, and holding that carriage closed is a ball bearing locking mechanism. Now with respect to that mechanism, I do have to note a problem. The locking ball on the back side is missing on this one. It does stay locked because of the other ball, and I have no reason to believe it's a widespread issue. However, given that this is a ball bearing mechanism, not putting one of the balls in is a significant QC failure, and something Abus may need to look into. Now securing everything is Abus's X Plus disc detainer core. It has eight discs, each with false gates and a disc locking system, preventing any of those discs from rotating until a key is inserted. It's a fairly tricky core, so let's see what it takes to pick it open. The first thing we need to do is rotate all of those discs as far clockwise as they will go. And as I said, we have a disc locking system, so I'm reaching all the way to the back where those locking tabs are, putting a little bit of torque on that tool and just jiggling it around until those tabs let go. I've now rotated all those discs to where I want them to be. So we're gonna take out the pick that Bosnia and Bill and I made, pick up disc number one and get to picking. Okay, I'm gonna start in the back. Most of these X plus cores bind from the back. Okay, nice click out of number eight. Nothing on seven, six, Little click on five, click on four, and a fair bit of movement on the core. Number three, I think three's in a gate. So is number two. Going back three, okay, four. That was binding, I moved him just a little bit. Move him a little bit more. There we go, four feel set. Nice wide true gate. Moving on to five. Five is binding. Gotta click there and it's still binding. Let's move him a little bit more. There we go, five feels like it's set. Number six, six feels like it's in a gate. Number seven, it's a little bit of movement there. I'm gonna leave him alone for now. Number eight is definitely binding. There we go, that was the last disc. So as you saw, it's a pretty tricky little pick and putting aside the quality control issue this particular one has, it's a lock that I wouldn't hesitate to use myself. In any case, that's all I have for you today. If you do have any questions or comments about this, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.